How's it going, everybody? Today I'm back on the Dance Game and Dance Hype Train because today we're checking out Chucky vs. a Giant Tortoise. <laughs> what a goofy title for a track, man. Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm really curious to hear what this sounds like for sure. Um, I know this is off of their 2016 album, Mothership, and I haven't heard any of the songs off of that except for Man of the Year. And I listened to the Tree City Sessions live version. And uh, that was really solid. I went back and I listened to the original, and there's definitely a lot of differences as far as like um, little nuances in the live version, things they added, whatever, like improvisations. But uh, yeah, I'm really curious to hear what this sounds like because other than that one track, I don't know anything off this album. So yeah, let's get right into it. I really like this album art. That's a good harmony between the two. The drums and riffs really keep me on my toes. Like that. Bass sounds so good too. Like you hear it in the background. That was a cool note. So, Dance Gavin Dance, Chucky vs. the Giant Tortoise. Yeah, this is a really solid track. Um, I'll say that it does sound fairly similar to some of the other tracks I've heard from them, but I don't take that as a bad thing. I take that as, like, they have a very original sound, and they stick with it, and 
I think a lot of it has to do with Will Swan's guitar playing because he has such an original sound that um I mean he's literally created his own kind of separate like subgenre of like swan core bands and stuff. But um I mean aside from that, like I haven't really listened to a bunch of those bands. I've pretty much just listened to Dance Gavin Dance. But anyway, um one thing I found really interesting about this was right at the beginning I noticed that this gave me vibes to uh, Synergy off of Jackpot Juicer as one of the singles. Instantaneously, that chord that they play out in the beginning sounds almost exactly like what they play in being a Synergy, which is fine. I mean, to be honest, it's almost like a callback, and it kind of made me a little more hyped for this song, because I was like, oh, shit. Yeah, I, I remember this sound. But, um... I imagine that's got to be kind of unique for like me and some other people that are just getting into dance cam dance because you know if you heard mothership first and then you go into jackpot juicer you probably had the inverse reaction where you're like wait that sounds like chucky versus giant tortoise holy crap you know that's pretty wild um so it's really neat when i kind of have those like aha moments with this band because they have such an original sound that i feel like i can do that you know there's songs that stick in my head and i'm like oh yeah that kind of sounds like uh feels bad man or whatever um stuff like that i haven't had that moment yet and i don't know if i will because from what i've heard it kind of sounds like jackpot juicer is one of their best albums they've ever made so i mean if that's true that's cool because you know that's my introduction so it's a you know really good way to get into the band but also um it shows that they are branching out and trying different things while staying in their style which honestly is like the perfect combo. You know, just having a little bit for everybody in such a huge album. I mean, there's so many tracks on Jackpot Juicer. But um, yeah, going back to this track in general, um, yeah, I mean, it is pretty much what I expect. There are little things that kind of threw me off guard with the extra pauses and like the drums kind of keep me on my toes. But overall, just really solid playing, really solid performance. You know, Tillian and John always doing their thing. Um, they had really good synergy. Ah, see what I did there? Synergy. They had really good synergy together in this track. Um, yeah, overall, I have no complaints. I mean, it's Dance Gavin Dance. They write banger after banger, in my opinion. Um, yeah. What do you guys think about this track? Did you like it? Did you not like it? Leave a comment down below. If you have any recommendations, you can leave a comment down below as well. As always, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and as always, you guys take it easy.